Hey friends, today we're gonna take a look at the new card option. Before we uh, enable this card option, let's export this page here. You can see we have multiple lines and um, we're gonna head on over to Notion to Anki and uh, upload, bam. So you can see we got seven new cards and this is what we have in Anki, which actually doesn't look like what we had in here where everything was separated into multiple lines. So you can now use a new card option to preserve those new lines and we're just gonna head over to settings and then all the way here to preserve new lines in the toggle header and body so it will work both in the first line and also inside this will allow you to use shift enter in the toggles to create multiple lines for all card types basic close etc let's try uploading again and convert that Bam. and we're gonna import that and let's just go through the basic ones and then you see here's the multi-line one so you can see it looks exactly like this one with regards to the lines. So the first one is there, I pledge allegiance to the flag. And then this is the uh, basic one we had. And then you can see. So this is much better with regards to formatting. So you can use this to memorize lists. And we can. I can show you another example. So let's create a new um, deck here. We're gonna call this example deck. So let's say you wanted to remember some fact and then you have some information and then right below it you have some more information and you could for example make that a close deletion you could add a new line and then uh, another close deletion maybe there so this way you can control what's before and after and let's export that to show you that close that the option is already set so we don't need to change anything we're gonna hit convert bam import that into Anki and you can see we got two cards so you can see some facts and then there so I hope you're gonna like this and uh, let me know in the comments what you think uh, make sure to like and subscribe bye